Bronson, so glad to see you. What do we got here, Fulton? Oh, you are glistening today. It's never gonna happen, Fulton. Why? Fulton, shut up. What do we got? Right, uh, <clears throat> we have an attempted suicide. Caucasian male, 47 years old. Okay, here's the drill. You two nerds wait out here. I'm going in. Call for backup. I ain't staying out here with him. Why? If I was about to blow my face off, I would want to be staring at a hot, beautiful, fertile young woman, not an ogre. Okay, go find one. You know what? Sticks and stones. Ugh. He cheated on his wife. I've seen this before on CSI Miami. No, his wife cheated on him because he's got man titties. I got this. Hey, hey, listen. If you're going in, whatever you do, do not, I repeat, do not use your reverse psychology on him. I will. Oh, my files. See you later, kids. I love you. Here. Looks like you're about to blow your brains out. How much work are you gonna get done then? I know what you're trying to do. You're a cop. Says who? I'm off duty. So the faster you do this, the faster I get to go home and watch Young and the Restless. We'll go. Go watch your soaps. I can't. I'm on duty. Even when I'm off duty, I'm on duty. Duty doesn't diddle daddle. Diddler. Huh? Nothing. Just talking. Buying me time to move closer to you. Find me time to move closer to you. You haven't moved at all. But I'm closer to you now. Okay, look. What are you, what are you doing? If you're gonna do it, grow some balls and do it! What is that, some kind of lame attempt at reverse psychology? She is playing this by the book. She's not playing this by the book. She's using her reverse psychology, which I specifically told her not to. Is that reverse psychology? Fulton, shut up. All I know is that the Young and the Restless is on in 30. What a waste of time. Sitting there, day in, day out, watching these made up lives of petty, self-absorbed characters while your own life just slips away. Weeks, months, years, until you realize that you've traded your own life for the made-up lives of these pathetic characters. Meanwhile, the planet is dying. There are wars for oil. People are starving. And I am the one who's crazy? Oh my god. Oh my god, it's so true. I've been watching those shows since I was six. Five hours a day, five days a week, for years. Years! And for what? <laughs> to watch these gorgeous, talented actors inject paralyzing poison into their faces? Do you know how much that affects the writing? Their faces are frozen! I don't care about your superficial materialism or your soap operas. Of course you don't. Because that's what I care about. What's she doing? Man, your selfish little brains swinging between your little legs like a sweet, salty pendulum of perfect, sweaty desire. You stupid man buns and hipster facial hair. It drives me wild. You got a wifey? What's it to you? You bet she's beautiful. You're not so bad yourself. What? Take you for a rodeo. What? Never mind. Who's the lucky girl? Beth. My wife's name is Beth. She hears you calling, but she can't come home right now. How do you know all You got this? a kid too. Five, turning six in May. Who told you that? I get signals, man. Signs, symbols. She's young enough to know what's going on, bro. Old enough to tune it out. I get it, dude. But your baby girl, she's gonna need her daddy. I needed my daddy when I was growing up. My daddy wasn't always home. But when he was, I was lucky to have him there. I still am. You, you, still, live at, you still live at home? Yeah, but this is about you, Dean! How the hell do you know my name? You're good. Guess 
something happened to my daddy, I would blow my brains out. No, no, you wouldn't. <laughs> no, I would. And then I would watch the blood splatter all over my shirt because my eyes would be dangling out of my face. Wow, she's a natural. Why would you do such a stupid thing? Exactly, Dean. Why would you do something so stupid? What are you doing? No! Ronson! No! Ronson! She killed herself. She's crazy. Oh my god, Ronson. Don't you ever do anything like that again! What?